development in the city itself. This city has expanded to something like 10 times what it was at Independence. And I don't think, I don't know whether we are trying to find dignity for the dead or this is going to create a situation in which developers will see this as a very prime line and have to see a situation in which the cemetery itself is expanded. Because the cemetery is next to a forest and the forest is big. And I have a feeling that it was invaded from both the north and on the other side, of course, there's a freeway. Having said that, I still agree with what Honorable uh, War is saying, that dignity has got to be there. The other thing is, why are we finding bodies out there? Is it because people have invaded the graves themselves to look for valuables or the graves are shallow? So more than anything else, what we need to do is that we have to have a system in place of the national government in which the police, as a national government function, protect the dead. The citizens cannot protect the dead. And also to put down standards for graves. The graves have got to be at least five feet deep. They don't have to be shallow. Who makes them shallow? Is it the county government or the national government or the people of Kenya? No. The families who are going to dig, what do you call, bury the dead there must be told that these graves have got to be a certain standard and the standard itself has got to be regulated and that regulation itself has got to be enforced. So we can't close that thing. And, and, and but what I want to see is that do we have a lot of land up there and is there an encroachment by the developers? And why was that allowed in the first place? Why were the developers allowed to encroach on the land that was set aside for the cemeteries from the colonial time? Why can the gov county government and the national government create a dignity for that? One, by having standards, and two, by making sure that this thing is protected. There are always people out there moving in the cemeteries, protecting the cemeteries. We don't have to reinvent the wheel. In my opinion, it's not for simpl so very simplistic. I do agree with the fact that burying the dead in Kenya for my Christian brothers and sisters is a very expensive thing. And somehow we all basically are, are, and we sympathize and empathize and see the, you know, the problems that families suffer.